I feel like my body is starting to reject this song. Like the moment that it starts, I'm like, no. Hey guys, it is Sophie and welcome to today's video. Today's video is super fun because we all want shortcuts in life, right? Like everything needs to be done as fast as possible. And when we're doing something, we want to get results yesterday. So I thought the ultimate shortcut in life is to do the two week Chloe thing thread challenge in one day. I'm going to do the whole challenge in one day and then see what the results are. Make sure to stay tuned and let's get started with the challenge. <laughs> All right, about the Chloe Thing two week challenge. There are two rest days, five different workouts, two to four workouts every single day. And each workout is between 10 and 20 minutes. I wanted to finish the first day before 9 a.m. and that was a success. One, 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 one shot. Now the future is yours, go. I was building on the lecture versus coming daily under pressure. Working on the plot. I just finished with the first two days and it is going well so far. The only thing that I notice is when, for example, I start to get a burn after like doing 20 seconds of a plank. I now get a burn after five seconds, so it is already getting harder. Um, but you know, fitness is just as much as a mental thing as it is a physical thing. So I'm not trying to say that it is super hard. I'm just trying to play as if it's easy and then trick my brain into thinking that it is easy. Um, but now it is time to get some breakfast, get some energy, and then let's start with day number three, which is a lot longer. So wish me luck. Quickly made some breakfast. I have some cereal here and some melon, some high sugary breakfast, easy to digest and quick source of energy so that I'm ready for day number three. My puppy absolutely loves the Chloe thing challenge because she wanted to join in on the fun and she attacked me, which wasn't that fun, but it was cute. She's the best. And here she's attacking me again. Cutie. Just acting like as if nothing happens until she sees the mic and then it is game over. I don't know if you can tell, I'm taking a little break, but I am sweating and I hardly ever I just finished the lower body burn workout from day three of the challenge, but you want to know what really gives that lower body burn? It is my resistance bands. Love them, super cute. I have the heavy baby blue and then the medium peachy pink. Comes in a cute little bag and we have free shipping. It's always free shipping for me. I'll pop them in the description box down below. Make sure to be fast so you don't be sad because I don't want you to be sad. And now it is time for me to do the fourth workout of day number three. Day number three is no bueno, but first I'm going to apply some sunscreen because I don't want to take the burn workout too literal. And I think it's another ab workout, so. Just finished with day three, the last workout, and you don't know how happy I was that the final exercise was not an up and down plank. I think we should start a petition that Chloe Thing can no longer add up and down planks in routines okay, but it is time for me to have a little break and then day four is up next before starting with day four of the two-week challenge we are going to walk our little puppy who's playing Chloe <laughs> hey hi want to say hi nope she's playing and we're going to walk the dog and then I'm also going to have a sandwich, eat lunch, you know, multitasking because I cannot have two long breaks because then I will be doing a workout at like 3 a.m., which isn't the plan. Um, and yeah, then it's time to do day four. I'm turning dreams into reality in the lab with the formula in chemistry. The memories fall to motivate and make the industry shake. We put the balls in the place. I'm talking one, one chance at best, yes. I just did the abs workout of day six and then I went back to check the time lapse and turned out that I didn't 
Well, I did press the record button, but then I also pressed the done button, apparently. So I only have like a one second clip of my workout mat and I didn't film the workout. <sighs> I've been doing my best with day four and day six. I'll show it in a second. Um, or after day six, whatever. I'll show it. But I've, I've been working hard on day four and day six. I've been doing them back to back, but you know, there really is only one way that I can fix this. And that is by doing the freaking ab workout again. Because without time lapse, there is no proof. And I'm not doing this entire challenge for someone to say, well, you didn't do all the workouts. So I'm going to do the abs workout again. And this is a lesson to myself. Double check. Always double check. Okay, no time to waste. Let's do the ab workout again. And we are back again with the abs workout. Honestly, it is the Spider-Man plank into the crossbody mountain climber for me. That is the hardest part of the workout because that feels like you're doing planks for four freaking hours and it is super hard. And that together with the up and down plank. I have switched to the up and down half plank because my shoulders were absolutely cooked at this moment. We're at day seven, still going strong, and luckily day number nine is an active rest day. So that means that we only have day eight left, and then we're immediately moving on to day number 10. I just finished with everything until day seven, and I said that I was going to show my watch. So it took me two hours and 45 minutes to finish day four and six and seven, because day five was an active rest day. And now it is time to move to the roof again, because I've been getting eaten alive by mosquitoes. So it is time to get away from here. So I'm quickly going to move on to day eight because I am dead. And I sat down uh, between day six and seven and I fell asleep. So I'm not sitting down anymore. I'm moving on to day number one, eight. One, 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 one shot, now the future for sure, let's go. Yeah, I was building on the lecture. Versus coming daily under pressure. Working on the plot and the scheme, the true stock trademark is at the edge. We're at day 10, and honestly, it's a mental game at this point because my body is sore, tired. I've watched the footage back and it's the low energy for me. But you know what? I'm pushing through and I'm honestly really proud because after finishing day one of the challenge, I was like, this is going to be harder than I thought, and I already expected it to be very difficult. Um, but as I said, it's a mental game and I'm pushing through, I'm not backing down, I'm not sitting down, except for now, um, because when I sit down, it's game over. And I am not here to, you know, reach day 10 and then quit before I end day 14. I do low-key wish that it was just a 10-day challenge, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, I changed outfits real quick, outfit of the day. Um, still in the same shorts, I'm wearing the Neo Green color. These are the Speed Shorts by Gymshark. I absolutely love them and I highly recommend them. I'll put my link in the description box down below. Make sure to check them out if you're interested. And now it is time to put my earphones back in and continue with day number 10. And I'm trying to see if I can fix a bun that will stay in place because my hair is, it's been in the way the entire day. Day 10, baby. That was day 10, on to day 11. There is a mosquito here who is absolutely killing my vibe. So I'm going to quickly grab some more anti-mosquito thing because I don't think that I'll be able to survive training in a sweater. Um, and then I'm quickly going to do day 11. Only two workouts, I'm excited. I'm so tired, I don't know how I'm still standing. I hardly ate, I feel like. And at this point, I'm just so tired that I don't even feel hungry, so. But I'm going to eat some more before uh, doing day 12, 13 and 14. First anti-mosquito, because I'm not sure if you can tell. He has been attacking me. I think this one was old already, but it's freaking annoying. 
I thought that I was safe up here, but apparently not. So I don't really know when I started this watch, but it has been two hours and 46 minutes and I run 514 calories. And as you can see, my max heart rate is 145, 154, sorry, um, which isn't that high. And that's because your girl has to do low tempo because I am dead. Like my legs are jelly, my abs are on fire, my shoulders are non-existent anymore. <laughs> but I'm going strong and now it is time for food. And then day 13 and day 14. And it is day 13 during these workouts. And I don't think that you can see it in the time lapse, but my internet stopped working. And I also got some ads during the workout videos from Chloe. Um, and I, of course, watched them because, you know, that meant extra rest and support. Okay, the yeah. it is now half past 10 and I'm about to do day 14. I am feeling tired, very sore and very stiff. The lateral lunges, especially my left hip, I just cannot get down. Um, my hips hurt, my glutes are very sore and I just have no energy. But I'm very proud because it is day 14 and here I am. Did I think that I was going to make it? No. But I, you know, I did my best. And of course I knew that I was going to make it, but halfway I was like, this is going to be a long day. So I'm quickly going to do day 14 because when I sit down, it is game over. Um, so yeah, and it doesn't get any easier. So let's do day 14, which I think is a long one. So. That sucks. versus coming daily under pressure. Working on the plot and the scheme. The true stock trademark is at the edge of your dreams. I'm talking one. One shot for the kill. The breeze cut freeze up. I have no words. I need a shower. I need five showers probably. Um, and I'm going to eat some protein because I didn't really have any protein today so far and I usually try to get 20 or 30 grams of protein in per meal. The reason being is, I don't, is that I don't really like to train with protein in my system as that usually sits quite heavy um, and I've been training all day so I've been saving my protein for later. I'm going to eat two of these um, little yogurts with 13 grams of protein each. I'm also going to drink a protein shake and then I'm going to go to bed and shower first like six times <laughs> and then I'll fill you in tomorrow about my results, what I'm thinking, when I can think clearly again because now I can't. I'm like a zombie, zombie mode. Okay, I'm going to do this and then I'll talk to you tomorrow. Cheers. I am so sore. I don't think I've ever been this sore before. So I wanted to quickly talk about the results of the challenge. I dropped one kilogram uh, compared to yesterday morning before starting the challenge. And that is most likely a lot of water weight. Any short term drop in your body weight usually isn't a true reflection of a change in your body composition. So it isn't a change of your like muscle mass and body fat tissue, it is most likely a reflection of a change in how much water you hold, for example. Um, so that happened. I do feel snatched, I have to say, and sore. Snatched and sore, that is what today consisted of. And I feel very fit because I trained a lot and I did a lot of bodyweight exercises, which I find very fun. Obviously doing the entire challenge in one day wouldn't give you the same results as doing the challenge in two weeks. And that is because frequency will win in this case over volume. 
at the end I couldn't get my heart rate up anymore I was so tired so I think I burned a total of 3100 calories which is a lot for me in a day but it definitely isn't worth the effort of training the entire day and I would burn more per session if I would have done one session every single day for two weeks so should you do the two week Chloe thing challenge in one day will it give you the same results probably not was it a fun challenge? It definitely was. Please make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed this video for the effort. I definitely learned a lot and I learned that I am definitely capable of pushing myself more on a daily basis because I was able to do so much more than I thought that I would and I already gave up like 18 times and I was still standing. That was it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if I should do more challenges in the future because I had so much fun. Like, I had so much fun. And I kind of miss it, I have to say. So there was really only one thing left for me to do. Hey, everyone. Just kidding. <laughs>